In a scene highlighting the challenges of addressing fare evasion in New York City's transit system, it took six undercover cops 15 minutes to restrain a single fare dodger at the Times Square station, the New York Post observed. The man refused to provide ID and yelled, Bruh! Bruh! You can't do this to me, no! in front of commuters before dropping to his knees, forcing cops to cuff him. The suspect had a bench warrant for criminal possession of stolen property and was sent to Bellevue Hospital for observation due to erratic behavior. During the 15-minute struggle, multiple fare beaters bypassed the turnstile or used the emergency exit. The incident occurred just hours before another fair beater mace blasted two NYPD cops at the East 116th Street station. Inspector Jonathan Bobin, commanding officer of the Transit Bureau's Special Operations Division, stated that targeted operations aim to get recidivists off the streets and curb violent incidents. Last year, Fair evasion cost strap hangers an estimated $690 million. Despite efforts by the NYPD, fair evasion remains a significant challenge, with an estimated 14% of subway riders and 41% of bus riders skipping payment. The transit police issue fines ranging from $50 to $100 for fare evasion. The deployment of 1,200 specialized transit cops, along with additional NYPD officers and state troopers, aims to address the issue, but some sources believe it's not enough to patrol the system effectively. As fare evasion continues to impact the city's transit system, authorities are working to find more effective strategies to combat the problem.